Hi there, my name is Daryl Yap. I'm a writer-director of uh, Vincente Men sa Facebook uh, page. Sa wakas pelikula tanghalan, an independent uh, theater group recognized by the National Commission for Culture and the Arts and the Film Development Council of the Philippines. I'm 31 years old. I, um, I grew up um, in Olongapo City, Sambales. And uh, what else? Basically, I am a theater person. Tas, uh, I just parang got myself involved into films just recently, for a year now. Uh, I took a mass communication major in broadcasting at Central Escalar University. Then I took uh, creative writing modules at Ateneo de Manila University. I took uh, public administration at Nanyang Technological University in Singapore. And then, what else? I took those... Um, I didn't have any formal education regarding film, but I had series of workshops uh, in theater. So, in an educational background. Uh, we got into film because we had uh, parang a fund. Sumali kasi yung mga, yung mga anak-anak ko sa teatro, sumali sila ng Pinoy Henyo. Tapos nanalo sila ng, how much is that? 40, 40,000. Nung nanalo sila sa Pinoy Henyo ng 40,000, I actually got the boost na, okay, let's do something about it. So, pinag-film ako. Sabi ko, sige, gawa tayo ng film. Kasi parang, Tate, Tate Ricky Lee, uh, Sir Ricky Lee is actually parang a mentor na hindi ko naman talaga naging mentor when it comes to writing. Pero I message him uh, regularly because I stage Himala in Zambales. Eh. So, I stage Himala. Direct Richard Somers is Corazon, ang unang aswang, dinadala ko yan, ginagawa kong stage play. Ni-revise ko yung script nila. Pumayag sila, tapos sinasabi na sa akin, Daryl, mag-film ka na, mag-film. Sabi ko, wala po kaming pera. Tapos until, nagkaroon na ng, ano, nagkaroon na ng, nagkaroon na kami ng pondo because nanalo sila sa Itbulaga. So, we, we tried. Tapos, nung bigla kaming tinanong ng North Luzon Film Festival, the, the North Luzon Film Festival, under the National Commission for Culture and Arts and FDCP, Chair Liza Dino. Sabi, sali nyo yung film nyo dito. Tapos, there is a history. Ako yung unang nag-best director sa North Luzon Film Festival. Squaterina. It's a coined word. Squatter and uh, ballerina. So, I... Mas nauna po akong writer talaga. Before ako maging theater director. When I was still in elementary and high school, I used to compete uh, sa mga literary, like yung mga NSPs, yung uh, National School Papers Conference. So, talagang mas writer po ako talaga. So, before any, before any, before becoming anything else, I was really a writer. So, sulat lang sulat, sulat lang sulat. Tapos, nangyari po, kaya kami nakapag-short film because writer ako ng one-act play. Yung one-act play is uh, doable, is feasible to be, uh, to be transformed into a short film. Kasi isang, ano lang. So, so doon na po nag-start. Actually, trip-trip lang din yung Squaterina. Nanalo ng North Luzon Film Festival, dinala sa Compostela Valley, tapos just recently, dinala sa Formosa, Taiwan, alongside with uh, acclaimed directors na nare-represent niya yung Philippines. So, I'm deeply, deeply uh, flattered by it. Bago ako lumipad, was also considered as the people's choice at the central siglo, Sining Gitnang Luzon. It's actually a short film uh, contest in the whole of Region 3, Central Luzon. And then, I also have Oyayi. Oyayi is a deep Filipino term for a lullaby. It was then featured at the Davao Ngilngig. It's a short, it's a horror short film festival. What else? Um, Ellipses. Uh, it's a... It's a short film that is only composed of uh, 11 words. Pero po nanalo ako ng best screenplay doon. 11 words. And then, it only lasted for like 3 minutes. Best thing other uh, films na nag, like, mga 13 minutes, 20 minutes. Yan po. Mar marami po. After the beep, na kasama sa, uh, sorry, uh, North, no, no, no. NCCA, CCP, Gawad CCP. Yung bago ako lumipad po at saka yung after the beep kasama siya sa Gawad CCP 2018. Nito lang. Yun po yung indie films, uh, full-length indie films 
Cinemalaya, yung short film naman po ay Gawad CC. Medyo pa lang po. Yung sa Facebook naman po kasi, yun yung medyo parang siraulong ako. Pero yung sa mga festivals naman po, medyo pwede naman po akong magpakadisente. Pagka gano'n. No po. Actually po, just like what I've said, I'm really, my, my, my artistry is deeply rooted into theater. I want kasi a, a fast uh, feedback. Parang kapag nagpatawa ka sa teatro, agad silang tatawa. Unlike sa film, medyo... As of now, I... Masaya po ako sa film, number one, kasi yung pera, kumikita ako, unlike sa theater, hindi masyado. Pero, I'm getting the hang of the attention that is being given. And, uh, at first, I didn't uh, foresee myself na maging ganito, pero, I'm enjoying as of the moment. And I don't want to parang jinx it all, or something about it. Vincent Timmins is... A- Vincent Timmins po, as a backgrounder, was, uh, winnerd play ko lang yung pangalan ng cinematographer editor ko, with, uh, who is Vincent Assis. And then, nagkaroon lang po kami ng ganyan because I'm selling my play all over the country. And schools in the archipelago here in the Philippines, they are actually, they want, if, they, if we were going to stage the play sa kanila, gusto nila, makakita ng part ng play or makakita ng parang movie trailer kung sa film. So, sabi ko sa kanya, gawa na lang tayo ng page para hindi tayo dala ng dala ng, ng drive or ng whatsoever. Tapos, dun mo i-upload yung mga gagawin nating parang uh, stage play trailer. So, dun na po nagsimula. Parang sentiments niya, Vincent, tapos kinoid namin na Vincent means. Tapos po, nagsimula kami mag-post, paano ba? Ng mga plays namin. Tapos, ng mga plays po. Tapos, hindi pa doon po kami nag-boom eh. I actually had... I actually had uh, an artistic drought for like 2017 kasi I just came from a breakup during that time. So, wala akong ibang, hindi ako makasulat, hindi ako makaano. So, right after going to Batanes, pag uwi ko, sabi ko gawa tayo ng mga short films tapos try nating mag-viral. Yun na po, after, kasi I, I ended, my seven-year relationship actually ended last December 2017. So, mga one year na. Sa seven-year relationship, tapos we, Uh, my partner and I, we, we broke up. Tapos, parang lutang-lutang ako from January, February, March, April, May. And then June, nagbatanes po ako. While, while in Batanes, I decided to to stop my drama queen. Ano, my drama queen, Exayanas. And then sabi ko, sige, gawa na lang tayo ng ano, scene stealers para mapansin tayo sa Facebook. Then, it gave birth to Vincent Mins as the viral Facebook page of the Hard Eating Short Films. The first one was Bess. It's actually a lesbian love story of two girls na they are best friends, they, they, they take a bath together, they know the secrets of each other. Uh, yes, it became like 500k views. So, sabi ko, okay, I cannot use kasi two, ma- two male, Mas- masyadong giveaway. So, sabi ko, sige, I'll, I'm going to use uh, lesbians muna. Tapos yun. Tapos after nun, ang sumunod po doon was yung mga bagay na hindi na dapat pag-usapan about naman yun sa uh, infidelity. So, yun po, dire-diretso na. Tapos, ang nakaabot din yun ng mga around 600, 700K in like a week. Tapos, right after mga bagay na hindi dapat pag-usapan, Jowable. Jowable was the first million. I uploaded it like 10 in the e- I don't know, 2 in the morning. Pagising ko ng 7 a.m., 1 million na siya. Yes po. Parang ganun. Aside from the views, bumilis din po kasi we were like parang 200, 2,000 likers lang yung page. Right after Joa Ball, we became uh, 120 for like 3 weeks. Pero yung katuwaan yun lang? Katuwaan lang po talaga yun. Yung mga talents ko po kasi, mga theater actors and actresses ko. So, they were all doing this just for me to move on. Parang yun lang yung ano nila sa akin, parang treat-treat nila. Sige, gawa tayo ng ganito para lang maging busy siya. So, binisi nila ako, tapos hindi ko po alam na, gano'n, na mag, napapatok siya. Hanggang sa, dire-diretso na namin, kami na po yung halos ayaw na namin. Because it was not really planned. 
No, I just I don't want I really I I really don't see myself parang going viral and post it in fa- plus I don't want to be tagged as Daryl posting irreverent videos because I'm also capable of making inspirational videos and something like that and it's very dangerous nowadays to be tagged being just one face lang yung and I thank God that I didn't uh, name the page na Daryl kasi magiging ganun actually meron nga akong dilemma ngayon na iniisip nila yun lang yung kaya kong gawin like one angle shoot bastos yung content yung medyo not not naman bastos like uh, sex driven parang of course there there, there there are films that are sex driven but there are also films na very harsh in language something like that so okay na rin po yung advantage na hindi ko rin ipinangalan sa akin din yun. Actually po, I just message it through Messenger. Mm. I type it while we are shooting. I'm... With Joa Ball, I finished it like barely an hour. Nung nalaman ko palang, bumabagyo po kasi nun eh. So, ang script talaga namin doon, bangin. Miinom siya, tapos sumisigaw siya sa bangin. Tapos po bumabagyo, wala kang maiisip. So, kung hindi mo makakausap ang Diyos sa bangin, saan mo siya pwedeng kausapin? So, church. So, minodify ko yung script. So, siguro po, barely an hour yan. Tapos, the fastest po was like 15 minutes for for alamat ng titi. That was 15 minutes because I was asked by female group to come up with uh, an advocacy video that will actually glorify at the same time, parang put reminders to the male gender na they have to be responsible with uh, with with their... Ano, their doing. My style actually My style actually is a uh, my friends who are actually studying in UP film sa UPFI they, they inaasar nila ako na pa-edgy daw ako yung pa-cool na parang gusto ko daw lagi akong pinag-uusapan parang parang pasaway and something like that. Hindi ko po talaga yung sinasadya. Ay ako po maiintindihan ako ng mga nagtatiyatro na sa amin, normal lang yung mura, normal lang yung... I, 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 I know naman that, na normal din sa, sa sa buhay yung... Ako po kasi kung anong na, na, nakikita at saka napapanood nila sa sa Vincente Mendes, yun po yung nangyayari sa toong buhay. Kaya siguro, na-click. Hindi ko po kasi sinesensor eh. Bawa, minumura nung anak, yung nanay yung... I mean, yung teacher yung bata. Yun po talaga yung nangyayari. So, hindi ko ini-edit. So parang ganoon ah. Ano napaka raw, napaka realistic. Maybe that's my style. I don't want to I don't want to put fragrance on it. I don't want to make it colorful if it's not colorful. I mean as it is, parang ganoon po. That, that's that's basically the style that I want to uh, continue. 